Doing your chores? Yeah. Good girl. I think we could just use the trash bag <laughs> unless it's dirty. I'm tired, you guys. We're starting our day. The girls are doing their chores. Ashley's doing it. Just leave those there. We actually need to put those away in the camping gear outside. I've actually been up for a while. It's probably like 10.30. I've actually been up for like an hour and a half or so. Today, I am going to take down my 4th of July decorations. I'm kind of getting stir crazy and wanting that to be taken care of. I want to take a shower and kind of clean up and just relax today because it's kind of a rainy. That looks like it's like sunshine, but it's actually just rainy. overcast. But it's rained all night long. I don't think it's going to rain again, but it's, you know, cold enough that the kids aren't going to play a ton outside and all their friends are gone. Like all these parents put their kids in like full day camps and full week camps and I get like that you got to entertain your kids but like they've been doing this all summer long and like my kids have no one to play with <laughs> and they're I don't say they're sick of each other but they kind of are I mean they enjoy hanging out together and stuff but so it's just more of a get things done kind of day so I do have a little project that I want to do after I take down everything from the mantle. So I will work on that. So stay tuned to a little DIY coming up soon. Because I didn't want to take down the mantle until I knew what I was going to put up there. What? That's disgusting. <laughs> Did that just get made this morning? Or yeah, it seemed like it. Yes. Well, you're down here. Abby probably just came down and made it then. If it's still soft, Abby just came down. It was in the kitchen? Yeah. I think Abby just came down. So stay tuned for a little DIY project coming soon. I think Abby is going to help me make that because it'll be really fun. She helped me get the supplies for it. Let me give you a little hint so that you want to come back for it. When it's going to be large, it's going to be something tall that goes on my mantle and it involves dollar store items like mirrors. So there's the weather outside. <laughs> um, Anyway, it involves that and one other item. So you'll have to stay tuned for that project. I think I'm gonna do that. Take down 4th of July, kind of clean and dust, and then take a shower, and then I'm not really planning anything. And I would like to go out on a date tonight with Jason, but I don't have any money, so. <laughs> Maybe we could just go for a drive or something and talk. That's always probably a good thing, so. Start our day. <laughs> Okay, come here, really quick. We're trying on jeans. Small. Okay, wait. Let me button them up. Okay. Let me show you the pile of jeans that oh we're going through. Gosh. Look at this, you guys. Look how many jeans. And by the way, I'm doing my sheets, so my bed isn't made. I guess they made a little bit of a blanket bed, huh? Okay, take off those pants. So, I've got all these jeans. These are gonna be cute. She can wear these for a couple more weeks, and even into the little bit of school before it gets cold. These are size fours and threes that I that no one ever wore but these are all six and sevens that we're gonna try on so what size was this one Abby do you know I'm trying to have her go take them off but she won't let's try on another pair okay you're so cute okay show them they're too big these are the sixes but we're gonna try on the fives so I was kind of obsessed with these children's place jeans at one point and then I started working at Jimboree those aren't Jimboree yeah they are I'm going to have one. Okay. Anyway, look how cute these are. These are going to be way too big for her, but I can't wait for her to wear these ones. Okay. New pair. Set up. Show them what part you don't like. The boot cut. <laughs> Come forward. Someone at least liked these because there's someone at least wore these. The per the top is perfect. Yes. Yes, I know. Um, I like the it. top is perfect, yeah. but she doesn't like the boot cut part. So we're yeah. going to try another pair. Okay, Ashley, do you like these ones? Really good. Okay, come here, come here, come here. Come they're show really, them. They're really good and they don't have like... They're not wide bottoms. Yeah, they're not right? really wide. Okay, turn around. Look at this little butt. I just love the butts and jeans. <laughs> okay, so we found the right cut and size. Let's try a few more on. Okay. Here's another pair. Check. We're doing pretty good. 
good. You want to try the shorts on now? They're going to be the ones who going to fit good. Yeah, you like those ones. All right, so we got some shorts that we didn't know were in this pile. Come here, Chelsea. We see you down there. <laughs> Ashley, come closer. No. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Look how cute. There's little, oh, my gosh. Okay, so there's these cute little jewels on the butt. These are cute. She can wear these during the summer. <laughs> Ashley, turn around. Oh my gosh. Okay, so you can wear these shorts for back to school. You can wear them now during the summertime too. But these are good ones for back to school because they're a little bit neater. Thank you. And you can wear them just like with regular t-shirts before it gets too cold. All right, so we just finished trying on everything. This is our yes pile. We've got one, two, three for five pairs of jeans you guys including a pair of these are capris these are from Jimbery. there's a cute little i actually have the little cupcake clip that matches that one super cute these are size sixes and then i have the one size seven is that flower one and then a size eight so a lot of sixes for next year we'll save those ones and then these ones are all to donate they're all size three fours and one pair of five that just didn't fit anymore. All right, we're kind of doing a different spin on the day. Abby went through her closet, right Abby? Yeah. Are we doing a yes pile and a no pile? Oh yes, super cute. Yes. Chelsea, you're gonna like that one. Yes. Oh, that one's super, so Abby, are you sure? Not like the stars. Oh, but Chelsea will like that one. And you didn't wear that one it's at all. Nice. You don't want that one? Is that one did too pink and she didn't really like it. Oh, that one's super soft. Oh, yeah. What does it say? It's great on you. Yeah. Yeah, that one's cute. And that one's our cactus one. Yes. That one's Love cute. Cactus. No. No? The words on here are really crazy. Yeah. You don't like that one, Chelsea? Yeah. So we just tried on some pants. These are totally you. Right, Chelsea? Mm hmm Yeah. Really they work really good. Okay, so then we have all of these shirts, Chelsea, that you can put into your bedroom. So how many did we find of Abby's? One, two, three, four, five, six, six seven, actually eight, this one, and nine. So this one would be really cute with this. Actually, what would be really cute with it? Well, the, the color is just a little bit off. Yeah. But it's that idea, is wearing like, like a long, cozy sweatshirt with them. <laughs> I know you don't want to be on camera. Go put those away. Here we have the far pile over here is donate because I don't think that anyone will wear that pile. And then some of that was given to us and it's just not our style. So we're okay to donate it. This is all worn out, done with, you know, and then we've got shoes that are just too big and we're just going to tuck those away for now. I still haven't taken a shower folks, but Ashley is over here making mac and cheese for their lunch. I am going to quickly just take down the 4th of July stuff. Because if I don't do it today, it's going to seriously drive me nuts. So, I've got pieces on here and here. Then we've got all of this stuff here, including a cup and some flowers that are now done. This guy is still good, so I'm going to leave him here. Not sure how I'm going to do this. I'll just probably leave that in the basket. I've got some guys here, but this mat is filthy. These are actually just drying racks. And I'm just gonna toss that into the wash. And then all of this Aloha stuff is gonna go away. And then I'm actually kind of sad to see some of this go because I don't know what to put in its place. This guy needs to get undone and up there. And any more that I happen to find along the way. And what I'm going to do, I have this whole counter cleared off right here. I'm going to put it all onto this counter and then I'll get my 4th of July bucket and we'll put it all away maybe after I take a shower because it just goes into one bucket. Right, Ashley? Yeah. Are you stirring that mac and cheese? And look at these cute little shorts. I mean, is that just the cutest little butt you ever did see? I think so. Yeah. Are you making mac and cheese? She's such a big girl. Oh, careful. You stirring it good? You must be in first grade. You don't want me to. I don't want you to grow up. Nope. But you're going to be like having one in fourth grade. You're going to be 16 and I'm going to make you lay in bed with me and tickle my back and brush my hair. No. <laughs>
<laughs> all right, so I've taken the tray off and taken off all the 4th of July. I'll show you that in the front in just a second. And then I moved the cake stand over here in the corner. I just kind of wanted it to be more showcased. Before it was kind of in this corner and didn't really get much attention and it made it kind of cluttery over here. So we're gonna cut that watermelon tomorrow. So I'm just trying to keep it out on the counter where I can see it. And this corner is cute. I did a yellow mat this time instead of the blue one. And then obviously I don't think I'm gonna leave my ring here where it's like more on display. So I'll definitely take that upstairs. But I like the kind of pineapple, teal, and yellow theme right there. The table is all cleared off. I just need to wipe that down. All right, I've got the mantle all cleared off. And see how lonely it is? This is why I haven't done it yet, because of the mantle. It gets so lonely when there's no like holiday decorations on it, so I hate to take down the decorations. It's also super dusty. So while I've got the dust spray out, I'm gonna do that and the TV cabinet right here. All right, so you'll have to ignore the kids upstairs. They're just playing, they're being good, but they're just making noise. This is all un 4th of July. I didn't have to arrange anything differently for the most part. The whole thing needs a dusting, but I do not have it in me today. <laughs> so that is all done. I wanna rearrange a few pieces, but like I said, I'm just running out of energy. The one thing I added, a cute little trailer was that little banner but soon I'll get to add those on Sundays when we play we had our first preseason game and won so that will go up every once in a while when they play so this table is nice and bare again so I've got to figure out what to do with a few of these spaces all right so here is the tray that I think I'll do on the table did the yellows and blues and teals and I'm going to add some more white flowers to this bunch and kind of spruce that up just a bit. And I got this tray at the dollar spot at Target. This is the one I used for Abby's birthday. All right, so here is all the 4th of July decor. And I just need to put it into the bin along with the little Hawaii stuff that I've got right here. Well, you can't, I can't turn it around. So I've got to put that one in a separate bin because I don't want to break these little guys. So I just, they're too delicate, so I wrap it and I put it in a Tupperware in my laundry room. Okay, Ashley has something to show me. They've been playing good. Come down. Hurry quick. Cover your eyes. Come down here. Well, I'm not showing her eyes. That's the surprise until she's closer. Come on. Come closer. One more. Okay, close your eyes. Oh my. You want to hear it? Close your eyes. Wow. Did your sister do that? Yes. It is quite fancy. So you wanted Abby to do your makeup? Yeah. She's been begging me all day. She's like, Abby, can you do my makeup? Can you do my makeup? Can you do my makeup? It looks cute. Guess what? Like, Mom's going to take a shower. Mm. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and it's my turn to go shower. Can I watch it for a minute? Um, yes, because you've been really good today. Okay? Yeah. You guys are cute. You've been doing this whole time I was getting ready, huh? Yep. Making American Girl doll stuff? Yes. What We're is that going to be? a dog house. It's going to be a dog house? It's going to be hard. Yeah. You can use it for one of your little dogs. Looks like Abby's made more pillows. Super that cute. One the old one. And then what's this, Abby? Couch. A couch? Apparently it's a couch. All right. I'm going to go get your movie. You wanted a movie, right? Yes. <laughs> Pikachu, and I'll run to the bank and I'll be home, okay? Okay. We'll have a movie night? Yeah. Movie night. Do you want pizza for dinner? Yes! Yay! Okay. All right, so we have a little bit of a different scenario now. Ashley, she's all bundled. What was your temperature? Uh, you didn't tell me. You didn't tell, I didn't tell you? A 100.6. 100 100 so we need to wash your face off, okay? And we need to get you some Tylenol, okay? and see if we can get you feeling better. That came out of the nowhere, didn't it? Yeah, she didn't really want to eat dinner. All of a sudden said she was cold and didn't feel good. I touched your forehead and you were sick, huh? Okay, you rest, okay? I just realized this is cold and a cough. <laughs> Don't need to knock her out. I'll just get her some kids ibuprofen, if you have any, and 
Oh dear. And then see if I can get her to go to bed. Jason's on his way home from work. I think he had a good day because I was hardly ever able to get a hold of him. So that's probably a good sign. I'm gonna get Ashley ready for bed. It's only six o'clock. I'm way ahead of schedule for dinner and whatnot. Oh, I didn't tell you. I went and got pizza on my way to go and get their movie. So they've had dinner as well. Everyone but Ashley had dinner. Sorry, I'm trying to get medicine out there. So, she won't eat. I'm just gonna try and get her to drink a little bit of milk. Here, Ashley. They're watching Pikachu. The detective. The detective Pikachu. Sorry, apparently I said that wrong. Here, put this in your mouth, swallow that. Oh, and the kids use my decorations to prop up their iPad. And I gotta put all this stuff away. But it looks like one of us isn't gonna go to church tomorrow. Oh, I gotta spill it over there, I gotta clean up. So one of us is staying home from church tomorrow and sometimes <laughs> um, we play rock, paper, scissors on who gets to stay home. <laughs> is that bad? And we can't convince, we can't let our oldest know that she needs to stay home, that Ashley needs to stay home or else my oldest We'll use that as an excuse to not go to church. She needs to go to church. So we will see who gets to stay home tomorrow. Don't want to get other kids sick, especially as we kind of end the last couple weeks here of summer. But anyway, I feel good about what I got done today. I am still editing. Um, I'm almost current day. I'm almost to today's video. I'm gonna work on yesterday's video and then I'm I don't know that you guys know this. Let me go in the other room and talk to you about this. Um, so I schedule out on my channel. I'm normally scheduled out like a week ahead of time. That's for my own sanity. So that I'm not editing current day videos the same day. That's really, really stressful. I've done that before. And it really stresses me out, which then stresses the family out. And I'm not taking care of them, which is my number one job. This is my second job. Neither one of them pay me well. <laughs> Neither one of them pay, pay me at all, to be honest. Um, anyway, so right now I'm actually scheduled out over a week. If you haven't seen my little notebook. If you have a YouTube channel and you follow this, let me know if you want a notebook like this. My sister made this for me and I love it. So leave a comment if you have a YouTube channel and you want me to, I can either send you the PDF of this or whatever file type it is, I don't remember. Um, it can pay me for that or I can have one printed and I can mail it to you. There's a cost to either one of those. Let me know if you're interested. But in order to like help my life out, I schedule out in advance. And as of today, if I can get caught up on the last two videos, today's and yesterday's, I will be scheduled almost a week and a half out. If I get another DIY crafty video done tomorrow, which I probably will, if I can get convinced Jason to let me stay home from church, then I will be scheduled a week and a half out. I know you guys think that these videos come out like, you know, their current day type scenarios, but they're not. <laughs> and I'm not good at posting on my public Instagram account. And so anyway, I need to do better at that. But I wanted to ask you if you, I get like, I wonder, do I need to post on my Instagram account in conjunction with the current video that's posting that day? Or do you want me to be like live in the moment? Like, I think that's where my lag time and my delay on posting things to Instagram because it feels like I'm having to kind of conjure up the memory of whatever that post was about, whether it's a video or that day, because it's usually a week and a half ago. That's hard for me to kind of go back to those thoughts. But if I can go current day, like I do on my regular personal Instagram, it's easier because you take a picture of your kids and you're in a moment and you post about it and you have the thoughts and feelings and whether it relates to our video that day or not, you guys want me to do that. And if you haven't followed me on Instagram, you should go do that. I'll leave it across the screen. I think that's what I usually do. It's just Dana Creates over on Instagram. So anyway, just thoughts, random. We'll get Jason home, see if he wants to say hi to you guys. Otherwise, looks like I'm gonna have to call it a night and help Ashley kind of get feeling better. So thanks for watching all the little chores that we did today. They're not normal chores for Saturday. It's just trying to get things lined up for back to school and cleaning up the house and all that kind of stuff. So we'll see if we end it and maybe this will be my sign off and Jason will sign off on his own. Take care you guys if I don't see you again. 
literally just turned the camera off saying you'd be home soon. Oh, I'm home. And guess who has a fever of 100.6? Kaylee? Ashley. Yeah, our night just kind of changed. Not that I was doing anything exciting. Oh, poor girl. That's a 106? No, 100.6. Oh, okay. I'll no, I would have had her in like wow. ER, right? <laughs> if it was 106. Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, I'm hungry. I know. There's pizza in there. 